closer look at a story we brought to you yesterday where a man on a bike was seen on dash cam video throwing objects at cars. This happened in southeast Portland. Neighbors told us the man was cited by police but not arrested and officials we talked to say that may be because police are still having a tough time booking suspects due to restrictions put in place during the pandemic. Tonight, Fox 12's Michael Thomas is getting answers for us. The list of bookable offenses has been updated since 2020, but ultimately it's up to an officer to decide on what a person could be charged with. Now, people here in the Sunnyside neighborhood, well, they say regardless of COVID-19 or not, something needs to be done, especially when a significant crime has been committed. As the way we changed our lives during the pandemic recedes, so have booking restrictions in jails. But for Sunnyside residents like Jim Kodelka, pandemic or not, Crime is crime, you know. The Multnomah County Sheriff's Office says these are the current bookable offenses. Any Class A, B, or C felonies, any person Class A misdemeanor, second-degree criminal mischief, unlawful possession of firearms, negligently wounding another, followed by a few more. But some say criminals are still bypassing jail time. I can see maybe limiting the amount of people in the jail, but the... the, the uh, I've read things that there's just repeat offenders. They, you know, the people get citations and then within a week they're doing the same thing or maybe in a day. The sheriff's office says charges have been added to that list specifically for public safety and that prior to COVID-19, there were no restrictions, mainly because jails could accommodate more suspects. There needs to be a line to be drawn, you know, um, Portland, I call it the Wild West. Ultimately, if an officer or deputy is charging someone with a crime that is not bookable, then it's up to their discretion to simply issue a criminal citation. Repeat offenders, I mean, the writing's on the wall. The sheriff's office tells me right now there are only a few charges that they consider non-bookable offenses. You know, the stuff that's happening is just kind of out of control. Officials say that this list has and will continue to be updated based on the public safety needs. And as that happens, we'll continue to keep you updated both online and on air. In Southeast Portland, Michael Thomas, Fox 12 Oregon.